Hello again, YouTube. This is The Truth Man, and the channel is the No Matrix, No Simping All Subject channel. So this is content by request. It is from Charisma808, and he asked me to do a video about the things that women do to sabotage their relationships with good men. Now, I have six things, but they do a whole lot more than that, man. See, they, these women... They what what the modern woman has to battle is that inward trashiness. What do I mean by that? That desire to just be a 304. Sometimes men be in the way of that. And y'all gotta realize that when your relationship fell, just replace her. You know, just just replace her. Don't be down in the dumps like she's the last woman alive. And you ain't gonna never get none no more, or this, that, and the other. She probably wasn't even giving you none. So, <clears throat> here we go with this cold air. I just came out here. Things women do to sabotage relationships with good men. Number one, they try to soften them up. Listen, that's not your job. I've heard this before on YouTube from several content creators where they say the the woman is hoping to change the man and the man is hoping that the woman never changes. You're not there to change him. Obviously, you're not into the scripture because if you was into the scripture, you would know your role. Your role ain't to change him. Look at 1 Peter chapter 3. It says that he may be won by the conversation, which is another word for lifestyle in some languages. That he will be won over by your behavior, by your humility, by your meekness. What do they do? <laughs> Yelling at you. But if you <laughs> 911 emergency, he's attack me. And I'm not condoning it, but some man, listen. Some people be begging for it. Men and women. It's like now in 2023, you have to go out of your way not to shoot people and out of your way not to fight. It didn't used to be like that, but people just on this tough guy and tough girl stuff. It didn't used to be like that. Man, I'm thinking about thinking back to the 90s, I'll never remember a time. One time, and that's just because I just was, 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 uh, worked up anyway and that's I threw a basketball at somebody but I can't remember too many times where I got that mad at a woman even men like I had my moments in the 90s where I fought and things happened and things was escalating but I can't remember as many times as in the last 23 years where people just was trying to take you there. So they try to soften them up. Number two, they stop having sex. Who the hell do you think? Listen, either you slow, weird, goofy, evil, or all of the above, if you think that a guy is supposed to give up sex to be with you, in this sexual generation where women intentionally come outside advertising themselves. If they know they got a jiggly booty, sometimes they'll wear something loose where you're going to just see it just slapping all over the place. They wear these yoga pants. They'll, some of them will flirt with you. They'll let you know, hey, I kind of like you. The vibe be there. But then some guys will have one. You trying to make it work with somebody that don't even want you to feel good. And like I told y'all before, usually the woman that ain't giving you none, she ain't gonna rub your back either. She ain't. But that red bone at your job will Yeah. But 
that you trying to make it work. We got kids, we married, we business for work, work, work. Yeah. Making nothing work. If it don't work, it don't work. Get something that work. Get somebody that work. Number three, trying to control them. Listen, man, I, I serve any woman that will ever look my way. Any woman, I don't care if you got the wettest, hottest, I don't care how pink your lips is, how pretty your eyes is, how pretty your feet is. I don't care how sweet you are. You could be a unicorn. You're not going to control me. You're not. If you try, you're just going to mess everything up. Well, I make more than you, so I'm still a man. If you don't like it, go find you one of these dudes who make more. I make a million dollars a year. I'm a celebrity, so you come over here, it ain't going to be none of that Illuminati stuff, and you are required to be submissive. Care about that? So number three, they try to control. Number four, to criticize and disrespect too much. Listen, I could go anywhere and get that. I work in jails. All I got to do is go back, which I am, to corrections and I'm gonna get criticized and disrespected all day my woman ain't gonna do it if you criticize me you better have good reason and your woman shouldn't be doing it always criticizing that's why I like that Alexander O'Neill that criticized and it's, it's weird the premise of the video right Day was so creative in the 80s. So he had, he was on a video with all these women. And basically the point he was making is the one he was with was just all she wanted to do was criticize, but he was around all these other ones that was playing to his beat. They ain't there for that, man. Dude, listen, do not let nobody in your church, you should never care what nobody in your church think in regards to your house. Church people will turn on you quicker than anybody. So don't give them so much clout where some of y'all just stand with somebody just doing all this stuff on this list to keep up appearance. Uh, where your wife at? Oh, we, we done. We broke up. Why? Because I don't got time for that. Well, you know what the Bible said. The Bible said the Bible don't say you got to work nothing out. The Bible says that a man can divorce. Deuteronomy 24, 1 through 3. You want you need more scriptures? I'll just let you read that. Nothing in that New Testament can override the Old Testament. If you think so, you don't know how to interpret scripture. The New Testament is supposed to agree with the Old Testament. In fact, why are we calling it new and old? He said nothing will pass away till all be fulfilled. Number five, they cheat emotionally. They cheat physically. Emotional is just a shade under physical, especially if they some, some dude had them touching on themselves. They wanted them so bad. But they your wife, though. They your girl, though. Man, listen, man. Listen, 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 listen. This is 2023, man. This ain't 1955. It's not. We in the last days, man. It's cold out here. Literally and physically. Number six. Try to treat him like he's a punk. Ain't no woman. Hey, listen. You don't let your kids turn you into no punk either. Where you just. She's breaking up the family. You trying to keep it together for the kids. So you got to be a punk. You got to be a punk at work. <laughs> Man, I'm going to tell y'all like this. And this is recent. I got took off the schedule. Because I was standing up for myself. I wasn't, I wasn't going crazy with it. And because... Mostly, I was just ignoring, like, what they were saying wasn't faced. 
That's the world we live in today. You could not say nothing or you say things the wrong way, the right way, and, and you still get punished. This is an adaptive world. You got to learn how to adapt to things. You don't put yourself through the ringer out of fear of change. You got to learn how to adapt to change. You going to lose sometime. You going to lose stuff sometime. You got to learn how to adapt. So this is content by request. <clears throat> Things that women do to sabotage relationship with good men. They do way more than this. They don't want no good men. They want a lot of these women even want you to choke them. Like they want you to beat them up. So some of them will try to push you just to do it. I ain't been with nobody that want me to beat them up. Because all they going to do, for one, I don't want to do it. For two, all they going to do, as soon as you get tired of them, you get mad at them, they going to bring all that stuff up. Like they did P. Diddy. Like they did R. Kelly. I'm not condoning neither one of them. But a lot of these things happened a long time ago, y'all. You got to watch what you do. These when I like to get kicked. I like for a guy to drop kick me. You better not drop kick her. You better tell her, hey, listen, I ain't the guy for you then. But thanks for watching. Keep tuning in for more videos.